Honestly, this vegan here, and it is Black Friday, the day after Thanksgiving. But we are not going to the stores today. We are not going to the mall. We are staying right here at home, and we are making eggnog. Tis the season. It is so Christmas time right now. I love eggnog. Do you like eggnog? A lot of people don't like it. And this is a non-alcoholic eggnog, and I am going to challenge my friend Sky John over at the Tipsy Bartender to make a spike eggnog because you know a lot of people like to get a little tipsy tipsy at the little holiday parties but we are going to keep it nice and clean today so here comes the recipe so i think you'll agree with me today when i say our recipe is so simple we're going to be using our blender and we're just going to kind of dump everything in we're going to add in the meat of one ripe avocado one 13 ounce can of coconut milk raw sugar lemon juice, vanilla extract, nutmeg, cinnamon, and cloves. Then begin your blending process. As the ingredients start to blend together nicely, you're gonna take off the top, your little pouring top, not the whole top, that's dangerous, and you're gonna slowly pour in your almond milk to make it nice and just good. I don't know what about doing it that way makes it special, but it does. It tastes just like eggnog. And as I was making this, I was thinking this recipe is pretty healthy. It's only a half a cup of raw sugar in it, and the rest is spices and avocado and lemon juice and almond milk. Like, it is pretty healthy. So today on Talk Time, I'll be doing something special. I was tagged by Lovely Lady Cakes. I'll put a link to her channel here. She is so great. She makes the best videos. She's such a good editor, and she makes good desserts and cakes and things. So go check her out. I was tagged by her to do the What's in Your Refrigerator tag. So come on in the kitchen, and I'll show you what's in my refrigerator. So I guess we could start with the things that are on the door. This is the thing we just made. And I put that in the refrigerator. Um, I have some Smucker Simply Fruit Black raspberry and I haven't used jelly in so long some water some diet cheese that I never eat because I don't really like it but I have it just because I'm vegan um tahini which I just discovered when I made that macaroni and cheese it is delicious mustard and down here at the bottom I have all these broths that I use during the Thanksgiving season vegetable stock this is the mushroom soup um vegetable broth and some triple sec. I've had this triple sec for a long, long time. I bought it, I don't know why I bought it, but it, it doesn't come in handy that often. Cause you don't just drink with triple sec, you have to put it in something. So yeah, that's that. Then over here on the inside of the refrigerator, I have coconut oil and I have relish that my grandmother left here a year ago now. Yep, a year ago now. I don't eat relish. She left that here. I don't know. Water in my Brita. I have Earth Balance butter. <laughs> this looks really bad, but you all know I make a lot of desserts. And I have some Spectrum Organic All Vegetable Shortening Nut Hydrogenated. And that's very counter to this Crisco All Vegetable Shortening, which is very hydrogenated <laughs> and I have this big carton of almond milk which I just just discovered in the store today and I think it's so adorable and I use a lot of it so I had to buy it I have celery from my dressing video I have a bag with one onion left in it um and nothing is in there so yeah that's all for today guys I hope you all have a great Black Friday if you're going shopping and things have a wonderful time if this is your first time seeing my videos be sure to click the subscribe button so you know when I put out new videos if you try this recipe do a video response or leave a comment below and just leave me a comment below in general if you want me to talk about something else during talk time or if you have any other holiday recipe suggestions and I'll give you a shout out when I make the video bye guys thanks for
for watching. I will see you guys on Monday. Then over here in the inside of the refrigerator, oops, I messed you up.